Flinder, Flinder, YouTube, team keep it clean, what's going on, it's Engraven here with another video Now we're so used to doing these videos for any free agents that the Ravens may bring in uh, Or any undrafted rookies that the Ravens brought in But this one, um, this one is just, I mean really just an update for everybody Because the Ravens have signed Tyler Linderbaum they signed him he was their second first round draft pick they actually signed him this past Thursday um, but he was their second first round draft pick you know of course being the first being Kyle Hamilton um, but they did sign Tyler Lindenbaum to his rookie deal they've also signed uh, Travis Jones to his rookie deal they've also signed Tyler Beatty to his rookie deal so the rate that they, they got a lot of guys to get through they got a lot of work to do because these dudes again they went into the draft with 10 draft picks and y'all know i was adamant about it i was a thousand percent sure them dudes that they ain't not about to pick no 10 people ain't no way they picking 10 people and i was right i was right but they ended up picking 11. so they have eight more contracts to get through now um before the way that the NFL contracts used to be, it used to be all over the place. It used to be just super crazy. Um, these rookies were getting like, whew, they were getting like a second contract type of money for their first deals. Y'all remember back in, I, man, I want to say back in the day, but it seemed like it was so long ago. But with the NFL rookie wage scale. Um, there's a lot less work that needs to be going through when it comes to the contract. There's still some holdouts here and there, and there's some little fine print that uh, some rookies and their agents and whatnot, they'll want to get tweaked. In the, but you pretty much know, wherever you're drafted at, you pretty much know uh, how much you're going to make. And obviously, for all the first-round draft picks, they are signed to four-year deals with fifth-year options. And everybody after that, uh, I believe, is a uh, just a, a four-round, uh, not a four-round, a, a four-year deal. Um, so with Kyle Hamilton, whenever he does end up signing, it'll be the four years with the fifth-year option and for every other first-round draft pick. And then everybody else, uh, and more so with the Ravens guys, uh, all four-year deals. Um, and obviously, the, the higher draft pick you are, the more money your deal will be for, and the lower you get it. Um, but the Ravens, they have eight more guys to go. Eight more. Um, so I'm going to try this exercise, see if I can get it. I'm probably not going to be able to, but I'm going to try it anyway. So those eight guys, are, and you could try it yourself too. You could pause the video or something. You could try it yourself if you want to. So the guys that they got signed are Lindenbaum, Travis Jones, and Tyler Beatty. So can you guess, can, you can pause the video and guess the other eight guys. Now, you can pause it before I go so you can go. You can try to write it down or something like that. But here we go. All right. So Kyle Hamilton, um, Charlie Collar, Isaiah Likely, uh, Pepe, uh, Jalen, Amar, uh, Jordan Stout. Oh, I got six. Uh, six. Jordan Stout, Jordan Stout, Jordan Stout. Man. Who am I missing? Oh, Daniel Falele. Um, ah, one more, one more, one more, one more. Man. Oh, Ajabo. Man, I did it. Okay. <laughs> that made my day, man. That was fun. That was fun. I actually did it. I, I can't believe we did it. So I, I'm, pr I'm proud of myself right now. I really am. So hopefully uh, you, you did the same thing too. But anyway, uh, usually once other draft picks start signing in different rounds that's when other draft picks. It's, it's like a sort of contagious type of thing once one person gets it then everybody else gets it and this is a good kind of contagious because it's coming uh it, by the way of a contract so i know jeff's rebic he talked about it with um he said with uh fourth round picks he said those are usually the trickiest to sign and the ravens had six fourth round picks but yeah, so <laughs> it'll all get done eventually. Everybody's been showing up to like the OTA. All the rookies been showing up to the OTAs and stuff like that. So I know more OTAs. They start on uh, Tuesday uh, of this week. So I I'm sure they'll still all be there. Um, but yeah, man. So yeah, I just wanted to give you all a little heads up. It is nothing to worry about. I, I, I know um, sometimes people can get, especially when it comes to contracts, 
Um, they can't even get worried when it comes to rookies not having signed that contract. Now, if it was going on into training camp or something like that, and the rookie hadn't signed that deal, then it's like, oh, okay, yeah. But for for many camp for OTAs and all, nah, it's 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 not an issue. And again, they're still there. You see, Kyle Hamilton, he ain't even signed his deal, and he's right in every single Ravens video that they post. Um, so it is nothing to uh to worry about or to fret about or anything like that. So. They'll all get done eventually. It's just a matter of time. I think some teams actually signed all of their draft picks. So Ravens, they uh, they they taking their time, but they they got a lot of time to take because they got a lot of draft picks to sign. Uh, but anyway, love y'all, team. Keep it clean. Appreciate y'all. Thank you all for showing a lot of love uh, to the different guests that we've been having on come, come through on the channel. Uh, there will be plenty more to come. Uh, I've been enjoying having bringing so many different people on. Uh, from so many different aspects of not even just Ravens YouTube or Ravens Twitter and just people that are Ravens fans that enjoy talking about the Ravens. Uh, so thank you to everybody that's been a part of that. And thank you to everybody that will be a part of that in the future as well. And thank you to Team Keep It Clean for supporting them too. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. We out.